April 21st, 2.45 to 6 p.m. We are going to have a live online virtual show for educators to learn more about using the technology, how to do live streaming with education. And we're really excited about it. And these are going to be interactive learning sessions that I am going to be the host and kind of MC master ceremonies for the whole thing. Some of the guests will come on and it'll be an interactive discussion. And others will just take it away and present. So I want to show you the schedule that we have because it's really exciting who's going to be on the show. So, you know, we're going to start the show at 2.45. I'm going to do a little 15-minute introduction, walk you through what's on the show. Then at 3 p.m., we have Jeremy Morris from New Tech who's going to be coming on. 3 p.m., Paul Richards, the original Screen Geek, is going to be coming on uh, at 3.30. At 4 p.m., we're bringing in George from Epifan, George Herbert. At 4.30, Shane Scrimmager from Telestream Wirecast. And then at 5 o'clock, we've got Scott from Live. I mean, we're talking about the most important products in this industry for schools that want to do live streaming. And we're going to talk about not just the individual products, but I'll be talking about the workflows and how they work all together. Because at 5.30, we're going to have like a roundup session. Not only will the EduStream be there, but let's bring it up full screen because we're going to have a chance for you to win some stuff. You can win a, pre a PTZ Optics 12X USB PTZ camera and a webcam. That's almost a $2,000 value. We're also going to be giving away a free license of Telestream Wireclass Pro for PC or Mac. So if you're an educator, you definitely want to sign up for this to learn more about how educators can use live streaming products in their broadcast. And if you could bring up the lower third, because I'm going to say it, and it applies to everything we do, it especially applies to education. In 2020, we just made stuff work. Not only did teachers step up and get, got the job done, but you learned it, and you learned it really great. And that's why in 2021, we're going to make it even easier and better for you to do. And with teachers, I know when you come back in the fall, after having the summer, to think about, to get more training for your schools, to get you better technology and better equipment, we're just going to be able to deliver an even better experience for our students and for our teachers to be able to provide. And we hope that the EduStream TV program that we're doing this whole webinar series will help you kind of think about what you want in your classroom going forward, some ideas about how you can use what you have better already, and more importantly, to have you embrace the technology. And I got to say it, most teachers throughout the country have embraced the technology. They've gotten with the program. They are the heroes who have kept our kids learning. And somehow, you've still even managed to emotionally connect with your students while you're being remote. Well, I think next year, come September, we're going to see some people still being remote, most people still back in class, but I think that hybrid learning environment where some of the students are with you and some of them aren't is here to stay. It's not going to be every day or everywhere, but I think every level of education from preschool to middle schools to elementary high schools and secondary education are going to have some form of technology integrated into their learning, but that technology isn't going to be just watching pre-canned videos. It's going to be using the technology to do live streaming, live remote broadcasting, live remote teaching. And one of the keys to that is to make it more engaging. The more engaging the videos are for your students, the more they're going to learn, the more they're going to pay attention, the easier it's going to be able to manage them, especially when they're remote. So we're really looking forward to this super special EduStream TV event, April 21st, 2.45 to 6 p.m. And you can register for that now.